I can't wait to see the movie. It's a classic. But then I got in there and it just, it, it tugged at my heartstrings, you know? Mine too. I was in there and I was like, no! But not left thinking, yes. <laughs> the ghost of Tom. <laughs> the ghost of Tom. The ghost of Tom. <laughs> it was great, so I really loved that movie. I loved it. Yeah. I, I didn't like it, I loved it. You know, the, the, yeah, no. the, the ghost, ghost of Tom. Tom. Yes, that's truly. Paramount is pleased to bring you our feature presentation. has just passed away. Join me at the crime scene. Has he been murdered or has he shot himself? Let's go check it out. <laughs> Tommy, come back, Tommy! At the crime scene of Tom's murder, we found these few items. This one, a bracelet cut off by the murderer. We also found a shotgun and a bullet, but we'd rather not show it on this TV. Thank you. We are about to interview one of Tom's dearest cousins. She might have been the murderer. Let's go interview her. Come join me right now. How did you know Tom? He is my cousin. How good of a cousin? One of my favorites. Was he nice to you? Why, yes, of course. Is it true that he was the richest man in your family and in the state of California? He is Tom. Of course he is rich. Is it true that on the will it states if he did die, you would get the money? Yes, that is true. And is it true that at this point in time he was having some difficulties on finding out if he should really give it to you? He was changing his mind to give it to his sister. Is that true? Yes, actually, it, it, it is true. And, but on the will right now, it does state that you would have the money. What would you do with it if you were given it? I would buy things for me and things for Tommy if he was still alive. Is it true that you were at the crime scene with a couple other people? Yes. Thank you. No further questions. We are now about to interview another one of Tom's relatives. This time it's going to be his sister, Clara. Let's go join her at one of her parties. Thank you. So, Clara, is it what kind of party are you having? I'm not having a party. Oh, sorry. I was misinformed. Is it true that you were his sister? Yes, it's very true. Did you love him? Yes. Did he love you? Yes, of course. Did he love you as much as he loved other members of your family? Yes, yes, truly. Okay, thank you. Now, is it true that you were at the crime scene? Yes. Why were you there? I was just there discussing his will. Why? He was having difficulties. Thank you. No further questions. We are now about to interview one of Tom's closest relatives, his niece. Could she have been the killer, the murderer? Could she have killed Tom? Let's go check it out. Christina, Christina, can we please have an interview with you? Huh? Yeah. Can I please have an 
just have an interview with you about Tom. Tom? Your uncle. Oh, oh, him, yeah. Is it true that you were his niece, his very favorite niece? Well, I'm not sure about favorite, but I am his niece. Do you love riding bikes? Yeah, it's my number one thing. I can tell. Now, is it true that Tom was going to um, take you off of his will? Huh? Is it true that he was going to take you off of his will? He had signed you up for a few things that he was going to give you, but is it true that he took was going to take you off? Yeah. Were you mad about that? Yeah. So, is were you mad enough to kill him? No, he's my uncle. And plus, he doesn't deserve to die for such a little reason. Is it true that you were at the scene of the crime? Yes. Why were you there? Well, he was going to take me and show me something. And I looked up and I just saw him laying on the floor. It was all achy and stuff. Thank you. No further questions. Ah, it's the ghost of Tom. Are you taping this? Yes. Ah! We are about to interview someone who has just witnessed the ghost of Tom. This particular person is his daughter and both of them played on a soccer team. He was her coach. Let's go interview her and see what she has to say. Thank you. Audrey, 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 can we get an interview with you? Sure. How are you related to Tom? He was my dad. Were you guys really close? Yes. Is it true that you witnessed the ghost of Tom? Yes. Why do you think your dad became a ghost? Because he had unfinished business. Thank you. But I have one more question. Is it true that you were at the scene of the crime? Yes. I heard it was because your dad wanted to talk to you about your soccer team. He wanted to... And then at the very end, he said that someone was hurting him. Do you remember who it was? I do not know. Thank you. No further questions. Hi, it's me, Detective Marielle, again. I have figured out who is the murderer. Now, I want you to guess. Please take a vote and tell the attendance person who, what is your final answer. Okay, I'm about to uncover it. The person's name is in this piece of paper. I'm going to unfold it. This is the murderer. Now, we shall find out if she gets arrested. Let's go. No, you can't put me in jail! I'm innocent here! I tell you I'm innocent! A year passed. They had never seen the ghost, and Hilda remained in jail. Then, on um, a year right after he was murdered, the ghost of Tom came back. He said that his business was finished, and that he should give the money to someone else, and that me, the detective, will find the right person. Thank you for watching our show. Bye.